Right there, guys and girls, this is Pixel, and today I'm doing something that you guys have wanted me to do for ages. Only Rocket League players will understand this, reacting to Rocket League internet memes part two. The memes for this video are 100% original memes provided by Rocket League memes on Instagram. Their link will be in the description as it was with the last one. And they actually do something quite nice. They put my video in their bio, which is really cool. I'm really happy that my video was able to give their page some exposure. They're now over 2,000 followers, so if you want to go check out some awesome Rocket League memes, then be sure to go over and do that. But also, before we get into this video, I myself have an Instagram. I've had an Instagram since when I started the channel. It's in the description as it has always been, but I never really announced it in a video. It's PickaPixelYT. Go to the link in the description and follow me because you know, that'd be pretty cool, and if you wanted to make some Pick a Pixel Rocket League memes, then maybe I'll do a video about that. So, just hit me up. It's funny, I didn't really use Instagram for a long time, so when I posted a picture saying, thank you for 25,000 subscribers, the picture I posted before that was a picture saying, thank you for 700 subscribers. So, it's really surreal. Be sure to go and follow me on Instagram in the description, but today we're going to head over to Rocket League memes and look at some Rocket League memes. I messaged them saying, I was filming it soon, so get your best memes up on the page so they can be in the video. Let's see what we got. When you get the Switch power-up in Rumble. Is that supposed to mean the teleport? Is that supposed to mean the teleport? Switch. Yeah, that's definitely the teleport. That can be a really overpowered move. All you need to do is go back and watch my wager with Max on Thursday. He ruined me. <laughs> with the teleport. <laughs> that dude, that ginger dude, he looks like someone of Coronation Street. When you have perfect chemistry with a random doubles player. <laughs> they are so mismatched, people. Look at that. We've got the girl, the dude, and he's just like, yeah. Yeah, all right. <laughs> I don't think I can talk about this one. I feel it would be a bit hypocritical for me to comment. <laughs> Can I copy your homework? Yeah, just change a little so it doesn't look obvious. You know, everyone used to do that. <laughs> and then we have the Dominus and the Dominus GT. I would go one step further. Let me make my own meme. There we go. I'm surprised you didn't use the Octane and the ZSR. Like, a quick glance, you can't even tell which one is which. Like, the Dominus and the Dominus GT, you can tell them apart quite easily. But a quick look at the Octanes. They look exactly the same. <laughs> oh, look at that. You type in Octane ZSR Rocket League, which is what I used to get this image. And there I am. <laughs> That's me. When you get a mystery decal. Oh, man. You need to check out yesterday's video. <laughs> that was literally me. The hype for yesterday's crate opening. I'm not going to spoil anything. Go back and watch it. It was mental. Oh, God. <laughs> Didn't we just look really, really weird when we were like 10 years old. If you're similar to my age, you're 18 or whatever, and you look back on pictures from when you're about 8 to sort of 12 years old, it is cringy, man. Here's a picture of me when I was 12. Yeah. <laughs> but hey, when the squad pulls out the win in overtime, looks go out the window, you get, you get hyped! Sorry if I scared you with that. By the way, you can see I've got a got a new pillow in the background. The creeper cushion is down there. I'm going to be rotating cushions. We've got Squirtle there. There may be some other ones coming. <laughs> oh my gosh, I relate to this one. When you've been playing League for 17 hours and your mum tells you to go outside. My mum definitely thinks I spend too much time playing Rocket League and making videos, but... It's my passion. I'm gonna- I'm gonna keep doing it. Sorry, mom. <laughs> What's the next one? When you finally win your first tournament. L again, look at that. Look, <laughs> you've always got that one kid in the sports team who <laughs> who has to wear glasses, so they have to have these, like, sports goggles. Just look at the kid. Look at his legs. Ah, oh, dude. <laughs> my ass and the Legend 27. If you haven't seen that meme, where have you been? Let's skip that. We're leaving that in 2016. <laughs> When you're trading with someone and they tell a shitty joke, but you really want that Dominus GT. <laughs> so you have to pretend you like their joke to get the trade. Goodo, goodo. What's the next one? Oh my gosh, this one. I've seen this before. This is amazing. Remember last time we had that meme with the Esper and the Merc, which is you versus the guy she tells you not to worry about? This one takes it a step further, and it's hilarious. Your aerials and the aerials she tells you not to worry about. Your aerial. It's a standard, decent aerial. <laughs> but this aerial, this one is probably one of my favorites. This is so clever. It spells out send nudes and then hits the ball like that. <laughs> that's great. That's amazing. Shout out to Minion2223 who finally reached Prospect Elite in doubles and solo. Well done. <laughs> Despite how many of you guys think I'm terrible at Rocket League, this is not something I can relate to. At the start of 2016, I'd never played Rocket League. At the end, I was at All Star. Boom! <laughs> when your friend asks if you have Rocket League on the Wii, 
Could you imagine that? Like playing in the same way you play Mario Kart. I tell you what, I was actually playing Mario Kart recently and it was so weird. I kept wanting to flip forward to like increase my speed. I've been playing Rocket League that much. I was kind of freaking out a little bit. Now Mario Kart is a game I'm not afraid to say I'm good at. I am amazing at Mario Kart. Anyone? Take me on, I dare you. I gave credit, but I did actually post this one on my own Instagram because I thought this was great. It was a great way to sort of advertise my Christmas crate opening because I did a crate opening on Christmas and all I wanted was the mystery decal. All I want for Christmas is you, you baby. I just want you for my own, more than you could ever know. The only Santa I believe in. The Dominus with the Arcana, the Santa, the Exodus Trail, and the Santa hat. Love that, love that. All right. Me, team. I got it. Teammate goes for it. Yes! That is so relatable. Yes! Oh my gosh, have you ever had this where you say maybe, maybe you say take the shot and they don't take the shot and the other team gets a goal. To try and emphasize the fact that you said take the shot, you just spam take the shot as if to say, dude, just listen to the chat. Like there's being stubborn. I get if you have an annoying teammate, you can be stubborn in the chat, but it is helpful to both of you if you just listen to it. It's like, what? It's like that. It's like that face. I relate to that one. When you made your account as a joke, but now I have a thousand followers. Yes, Rocket League memes. I'm glad I could help you get there. I really am. I spoke with them uh, in the DMs, so to speak, and they, they were they were so thankful uh, for that video I made promoting their Instagram. And honestly, if you like Rocket League, these memes show and these videos showcase what they have to offer. They're, they're really good. Like when you're having a bad day and they've posted and you see in your Instagram feed that just a Rocket League meme pops up, it, it does make you smile. So I strongly recommend you go to the link in the description and give them a tasty follow. <laughs> Prospect one. <laughs> oh, but look how ugly that looks. Look how ugly Prospect one looks. Like Grand Champion just looks amazing. <laughs> Prospect one. Whoo! I don't think I've ever been that low. <laughs> oh my gosh. They've done my favorite TV show and Rocket League, Spongebob. Okay. Welcome to Rocket League. How tough are you? I'm Grand Champion in Standard. Yeah, so? I never played with a party. Oh, uh, right this way, sir. <laughs> that was a great episode. It's the episode where he goes, how tough are you? I ate a bowl of nails for breakfast. Yeah, so? Without any milk. <laughs> <laughs> I relate to this one as well. Sometimes, on my off days, I do some dumb moves. And this one says, when you miss an open save and everyone in the lobby starts spamming, what a save. <laughs> the amount of times I've been what a save spammed because of one mistake. Oh my gosh, Rocket League is such a love-hate relationship. It really is. But I love it so much. <laughs> oh, Max, you'll love this one. When your homie hits you with the best center of 2016 and you whiff on the wide open goal, his reaction just... It, it encompasses the feeling of missing an open goal so perfectly. It's like, ah, oh, what is my life? <laughs> when someone says GG before the game starts. You underestimate my power. Whenever I say GG before the game starts is because I think I'm going to lose. <laughs> Things I look for in a girl. Boobs, butt, money, and grand champ. <laughs> oh man, that's great. <laughs> what is the girl in the top right doing, by the way? What? It's not pole dancing. That pole is not sturdy enough what are you what are you doing <laughs> just here hold my straw i'm gonna go to the toilet just hold that for me <laughs> the picture's not loading the suspense is killing me when you're about to get caught on a breakaway and your boy demolishes the guy behind you mm, yes i feel that one especially since i've been playing with max more recently and ever since my 1v1 video where i got trolled so badly i just kept getting blown up i've been ruthless with the demolitions max the same it's starting to become more of a strategy to blow people up and when a tactical demolish works it's like that face that's what it's like yes my girl if you lose i get to go through your phone me <laughs> win the game 105 goals to 20. <laughs> oh man <laughs> you you can't have that you can't have a looking through your phone Especially when you go on Tinder to make Rocket League videos. <clears throat> <laughs> Another inner me, Kernet meme. Go to bed. You need to wake up early tomorrow. You know, if I've got a shift at McDonald's, I better go to bed. The inner me, the doubles rank isn't going to go up by itself. And it's true. It just isn't. But it always happens. You always think, nah. I can squeeze another game in there. I always have a set time for me to go to bed when I know I've got to wake up early. But it always goes a little bit past it for that one extra Rocket League doubles match. <laughs> <laughs> when you name all the restaurants in a 30 mile radius and she still don't know where to go so you go to Neo Tokyo <laughs> look how damn happy she is and he's just there like <laughs> Neo Tokyo's a love-hate relationship I, I 
I really do quite like it, but then again, sometimes I really hate it. Like, oh dear. <laughs> when you carry a trash teammate for the win and he invites you to a party after the game. <laughs> no, no, no. I'll be honest, I'm guilty of this. Sometimes I think we'll win a game, I'll have 400 points, and they'll have 1,000. I'll be like, hey, do you want to, uh, do you want to team up? <laughs> Just try and, uh, try and capitalize on that. Oh my gosh, this is... <laughs> This is literally my, this might be my favorite one today. He's just there like passing a note, he's all happy, and then it reads, what a save. <laughs> oh man, that's so good. That's so good. <laughs> this is the ideal male body. You may not like it, but this is what peak performance looks like. This looks like a picture that I tweeted out of the Rocket League crowd, and I said, shout out to the 100,000 people who came to watch the game today, and it was just a load of those little ball people. <laughs> oh, that's great. <laughs> Joins a Rocket League tournament, and then the first round you get Rocket League Elites. That'd be like me joining a, to a tournament and then matching up with Jazer in the first game. <laughs> Rest in peace. That would, uh, that would suck. <laughs> Loudest stadiums in the world. We got an American football stadium, a load of American football stadiums, and then DFH. Come on, boys. DFH is where it's at. And this is the last meme that was posted since I filmed the last video, and uh, it's the crossroads in life. A successful job, a loyal girl or guy, lots of money and a fun life, or Rocket League. We always go to Rocket League. But that does it for this video. If you did enjoy it and want to see a part 3 in a month or whatever, then be sure to leave a like on it. Subscribe today to join the Pixel Army. Be sure to go check out Rocket League memes on Instagram in the description below, as well as my own Instagram. Let's try and get to 500 followers. That does it from me, and I will see you in the next video very soon. Ah, <laughs> oh, me malicious, lads. <laughs>